Lifting loads, controlling loads, landing loads is something we do all day and Robo Rigger is an innovative approach to help us manage those risks. Safety is what sparked our interest. It fits with our overarching strategy to be safer by design and focus on critical risks. Robo Rigger reduces or minimises the need for people to physically restrain loads and keeps people away from high risk activities. We initially started designing Robo Rigger as a wireless load controlling device to address the difficulty of installing wind turbine blades offshore in windy conditions. But we learned early on that keeping personnel away from the lifted loads so they can't get injured was actually more of the key issue, and particularly in the construction industry. So that's how I then got talking to Multiplex. We showed Multiplex the early prototype of Robo Rigger, and they showed interest right from the beginning. And then that eventually turned into a formal agreement for Multiplex to support us. And six months later, we had a working unit ready for trials. It's safer to use because it gets them out of the way of the load. They can stand back, orientate the load without a tagline, and then wait till the load gets to a level where it's down low, near where it's going to land, before they actually have to come in and touch the load. Working with the end users is something we do whenever possible when we're developing new products. It ensures we're technically aligned and it gives us confidence there'll be a market for our product once we've developed it. The collaboration with Multiplex has been fundamental to Robo Rigger development. It kept us focused on the safety benefits and functionality that they needed for their business, as well as ensuring it would be accepted by the site people who've just got to get the job done. When it comes to the support we've received, we've been working with a network of other companies including F&G Cranes who allowed us to use their cranes in yard for 12 months of testing and more importantly to obtain feedback from the dogmen who are the eventual users of Robo Rigger. Initially when Robo Rigger came to site we thought it was going to be very specific for large loads that were difficult to manoeuvre or tight spots, which we, it's definitely good for but we've also been using it day to day for all our loads and it's just really good having that manoeuvrability, being able to move it exactly which way you want it to go. You can orientate the load so that it doesn't swing out over public space and you can keep it so that it's in line with the boundary and stays within the boundary of sight. Yeah, the crane crew has really enjoyed being able to lock that heading or that orientation before dropping it down to ground. We could see from early on uh, Robo Rigger's potential to be a game changer for the industry. The new museum for WA provided us with an opportunity to pilot Robo Rigger on a complex commercial project. So far it's performed beyond our expectations and we're already promoting the safety benefits across our sites nationally. As for the future, I'm very optimistic. The value of the safety benefits from Robo Rigger is clear to see, but we're now finding the value of the data we're capturing for the cloud just as significant. Multiplex is already exploring the capability for Robo Rigger to track progress on this project. But more excitingly, there are other companies looking at Robo Rigger's data logging to track their materials from supplier to the end destination, just like the online parcel tracking systems. Robo Rigger will really take off when industry harnesses the combination of the safety and the efficiency improvements. This is a device that will save lives.